Jacob DeGrom back on the hill in game number one. Jake six and two and a 0.54 ERA thus on the season. Ronald Acuna Jr. leads off and he takes care of him quickly at 101. DeGrom lays down his marker. Three pitches, one strikeout. Two out and nobody on. Here's Ozzie Albies. And he takes care of Albies on three pitches. An eight pitch first inning for DeGrom. 34 in a row is retired in the first inning. That's come to bat, no score. For the 11th consecutive start, Jacob DeGrom has retired the side in order in the first inning. Two of them via strikeout. And left hander Kyle Muller, the top pitching prospect for Atlanta, will go for the Braves. It'll be his first major league start, and Pete Alonso will be the hitter. VR creeping down the line and that kicks away and here comes VR and he'll score the first run of the game. Well, VR was halfway down the line when the pitch was thrown and when it got away from Kevin Smith, VR was able to score easily on the wild pitch and the Mets fashion a run without a hit in the first inning. 3 1 on the way. Round ball out to Dansby, sliding stop to his backhand side, pops up, throws over, gets the out. And that ends the bottom of the first inning. But the Mets pick up a run without a hit. A walk, a ground out, a fly out, and a wild pitch move VR all the way around the bases. And at the end of one inning, it's 1 0 New York. Abraham Almonte leads off in the second. DeGrom with a left leg kick delivers. Swung on and missed strike three. He buried that slider to the back foot again. His kid's <laughs> loving it. Look at him. That is uh, priceless right there. He knows that he's watching something special and I think all Met fans are understanding that right now. Kevin Pillar such an inspirational story for the New York Mets. You know what happened to him here in Atlanta. After undergoing all those surgeries the nasal fractures and the like. One two pitch on the way swung on and missed gets a strike out of Pillar got him with a fastball away and one down here in the bottom of the second inning. Yeah, Jacob DeGrom's hitting 423 this season. DeGrom is 11 for 26 this year with six RBIs. He has, folks, six RBIs. That's more, that's two more than earned runs he's allowed. We're driven in more than he has allowed. That is just, yeah, that's, that's like PlayStation numbers. Yeah. There's the 1 1 pitch. Lifted in the air to left field. Dansby drifting back. Heredia coming in. This will be the center fielder, Heredia, who makes the catch in the Mets strand runners at second and third. So no runs, one hit, no errors, and two men left. We have played two. We head to the top of the third inning with the Mets leading the Braves 1 0. Guillermo yeah, Heredia leading off in the third inning. 1 2 coming to Heredia. And he lines one caught by the Grom. What can't he do? Cunha struck out his first time. He launched his 100th career homer yesterday. Again, the one two. Struck him out. High heat from DeGrom. Five strikeouts the second time he's gotten to Cunha. One nothing men. DeGrom goes to the high fastball above the zone. Acuna misses to win the inning. It's DeGrom's fifth strikeout of the day. And now DeGrom has faced 23 straight batters since he allowed his last hit. No runs, no hits in this inning. One walk. VR walked his first time, created a run out of it. Here's the one two from Muller. Boy, that was, yep, got the call third strike. Looked like a delayed called strike by May. One out, base is empty. Here's Francisco Lindor, who's 0 for 1 with a ground out. The 2 2 is caught on a miss. Excellent breaking ball. Back to back strikeouts. Three of them for Kyle. Now nobody on three infielders on the left on the right rather for Albies who bats left hand. Well that was a clinic right there from DeGrom slider change up slider and Albies is a strikeout victim for the second time. One out Kevin Pillar the batter. Wind in the pitch hard hit ball left side diving stop by Riley he gets to his feet throws him out. What a play by Austin Riley. And great job. Take his time getting up, even though it's a fast runner, you got plenty of time. We've seen him kind of hurry some throws lately over to first. That one, you see how he kind of gets on top of it more. Well, big moment now here in a 1 0 game. DeGrom 
Getting a little unsettled here with two out, a walk and a long double. And now Sandoval to pinch it with the tying and go ahead runs in scoring position. And Sandoval pops up on the first pitch. The R comes in to call, side retire. Big pitch by DeGrom. They're now two for 23 against him this year with runners in scoring position. So Jake will leave after five innings. He lowers his world leading ERA to 0 0.50, and he's now thrown 30 consecutive scoreless innings. It will also mean that Jake will be the first pitcher in history to allow one earned run or less in 12 straight starts. Not just 12 straight to start the season, but any 12 start span in Major League history. So here are Jacob DeGrom's numbers through 12 starts 72 innings, 27 hits, 9 walks, 117 strikeouts. It's like you took a video game and turned all the dials to make it the most indomitable player you could ever create. And that's what Jacob DeGrom has been. His ERA is 0 0.50. Albert Almora Jr. will lead it off. And hung up in Riley. Another great play at third. That's two of them for Austin. And Almora just waves his hand dismissively. <laughs> Can't believe it. While the Braves dugout loves it. Almost the exact same play. Yeah, another great play. Mets fans are thinking we got another third baseman over there. We got to deal with this. Who is this guy? <laughs> Couple great plays by Austin. So now Jeff McNeil will make his return to action. The last time we saw Jeff was in St. Petersburg on May the 16th. When for the second time he hurt his hamstring. Remember he cramped up earlier a week before. He gets a nice ovation for his return to action. He lines one into center field, and Heredia will have to play it on a hop. McNeil, first pitch he sees off the injured list, hits a rope for a base hit. Newcomb brought in to face Dom Smith, who's just one for six against him. And Dom rifles one down the right field line. That'll go in the corner for extra bases. Nito is in. McNeil scores. Here's VR coming to the plate. He will score. A bases clearing double for Dominic Smith, and it's 4 0 New York. Albies in his last 18 games coming into today, 11 extra base hits and 16 runs batted in. As this ball is tomahawked to deep right field, Ozzie Albies has left the building. A two run homer, and the Braves are on the board. It's now 4 2. Another extra base hit for Ozzie, his 11th homer. Kevin Smith. Bounce to third, double. First pitch on the way, popped in the air behind first base. Smith back now into foul ground, makes the one-hand catch, put it in the books.